Hello world, Lisa Fredrickson, your friend and computer science professor with another short screencast about access. This time we're going to talk about the error message, control can't be edited, it's bound to an auto number field. And that happens when you're in a table, query, or form where you're updating and editing data and you're attempting to change an auto number field. So here I am in a query, I've got the employee ID from the employees table, and that's the primary key field. And I've got all the fields out of the orders table in this query. And when I look at this in datasheet view, of course, the linking field, the employee ID field out of the employees table matches the employee ID field out of the orders table. Now, if I try to change order number five and give it to, let's say, employee ID two, I'm going to get that error message as soon as I type in a two. I'm getting the control can't be edited. It's bound to auto number field employee ID out of the employees table. The reason you see the table name dot prefix on the employee ID field is because we have the same field name in two different tables. So we're differentiating which table this employee ID field is coming from. Now, if I go over to the foreign key field here, though, the employee ID field out of the orders table, I could change order ID five to a different employee, such as employee two. As soon as I make that entry and go to a different record, then we notice that a different employee ID is being pulled out of the employees table as well. So remember, anytime you're in a table, query, or form, if you want to be able to change that foreign key field, you need to pull it out of the table on the many side of the relationship. The employee ID field here in the orders table is completely updatable. The employee ID field over here in the employees table was created as an auto number field, so access is going to control that entry. You won't be able to change that number. So that makes query creation very important. If you're pulling fields in to create a report, which is a read-only situation of data, you can't modify the data in a report, it doesn't matter if you pull the employee ID field out of the employees table or the employee ID field out of the orders table for purposes of showing it on a report. But if you're making a query to feed a form, which is a tool we use for data entry and update, then yes, you'll probably want the foreign key field so that it can be modified if that's what your data entry needs require. Thank you.